GigPay is a company I have personally enjoyed using and recommended to a lot of people for a few years now. And recently, they rebranded and phased out the name GigPay to now become Rainest. And with this new rebrand, they have also refreshed the app and added a lot of new features. So I thought it was the right time to do a new video that covers everything from account creation to all the new features in the new Rainest app. But before we do this, I think it's worth mentioning that GigPay is currently running a campaign where for the next couple of months, your USD, GBP and Euro deposits will be completely free, meaning no deposit charges will be deducted from your in flow it's for a limited time only and users will get four free deposits every month and this might be a good time for you to capitalize on the new campaign and keep more of your money now let's get into the account creation and all the other things you can do with the new app so to create your account first you want to head over to the google play store or the ios app store and download the app and you can then tap on i am new to rainers to create an account and select your country for me i am in nigeria so i'm going to select nigeria and then proceed to provide my email address and once i provide my email address an otp will be sent to the email and once i provide that i would have verified my email address and then we proceed to creating our password you want to make sure that your password is strong and it meets up to all the requirements on the list and once we're done we can then move on to um, read the important account opening information and then tap on continue and we have created our account. You can then turn on your um, uh, instant notifications and also turn on your your login um, method, whatever login method your device allows, say Touch ID or fingerprint. And once that is done, our account has been created. And now we have to verify our account. So the verification process is pretty straightforward, like it's always been on the GigPay app, the previous GigPay app, and now Rainest. So we're going to tap on verify now. And once we tap on that, you can see the process, what we need to do. We're going to have to provide our international passport or NIN, but the international passport is recommended. So that's the one I'm going to use. I'm going to tap on that. And it's going to take us to where we can then um, give access to our uh, to the app to take pictures of our international passport and also a selfie picture of our face to be able to um, verify. You want to make sure that it's very well lit. You're very well lit, and the passport is lit. There's no blurs, and there are no um, artifacts or anything to to obstruct the clarity of the pictures you take. And once that's done, it's going to be verified, and your account will become fully verified. And once your account is verified, next thing we can do is move on to create accounts. For the purpose of this video, we're going to test with the USD bank account creation. So tap on USD and then um, tap on USD again and tap on continue. And we can start to provide some information about what we do. So you're going to be asked questions like what you do if you're a freelancer or a content creator or a solopreneur, anything you do, you want to select the one that best fits your job description. And once you select that, you can tap on continue. And based on what you've selected, some questions are going to be asked. Like I've selected content creation. I'm going to have to provide what platform I create content. Um, I'm going to provide the URL to the platform, I my, my profile on the platform I create as I've selected YouTube. I'll provide my YouTube channel link. And then I'll also provide some information, basic information like my expected earnings for the month and my and earnings proof. And once that is done, I can also select if I'm going to be expecting to collect money from other people. If I say yes, I will have to provide some um, details of the add as many people as I want that I expect to collect money from. Just that option is there if you want to do that. And once done, we agree to the terms of service and our um, account uh, request will go under review. And if everything checks out, you will have your USD account to start receiving money. The same process applies to all the other accounts. Next, we are going to create a virtual um, card. And you want to tap on the card icon and head over to um, create card. And you can see that they now have the new feature for you to also create a physical card. But for the purpose of this video, I'm going to test out the physical card in a different video. For the purpose of this video, I'm just going to do the virtual card. And once I tap on that, I can uh, select on I agree and then move on to name my card and also select the color that best suits my vibe. And once I do that, we're going to um, enter the amount that we want to deposit for the first time and also the amount we're going to be paying for the card creation. And once that is done, we're going to click on next and 
it's also going to go uh, under review like the um, usd account creation and once everything checks out you will get your card and then you can also add and receive money by simply tapping on your any account and then entering the amount you want to enter or you want to add to your account and then um, you are going to go ahead to deposit. Say, for instance, I want to deposit 50,000. I'm going to um, enter that amount and select if I want to do via bank transfer or via card. And then I can get the account details. And if I deposit into that account, the money will reflect in my Naira balance on my account. Same thing applies to the debit card. If I select debit card and enter the amount that I want to deposit, I am going to uh, click on add money and link a card and then I can then uh, uh, pay using the card that I have linked and the money will be added successfully into my Naira wallet like so. So the same process applies to your USD account and all the other foreign accounts. You can just get your details and plug it into anywhere that foreign accounts are accepted and receive your money like so. And then moving on, when it comes to sending money, you can tap on the send money and then you can send money. Now there are more options. There is bank, there's mobile money, and there's the Rainest tag. So the bank allows you to send to a bank account, usually to be your bank account if you want to make a withdrawal, but you can also use the mobile money um, to send money to other the African countries and also you can use the Rainest tag and this will allow you to send money between two users if you have somebody else who uses, who uses Rainest you can use the Rainest tag to send money to their Rainest account but the um, bank account is mostly going to be the one that you're going to use moving on this is how you can create an invoice to send out to a client so there is a tab there for invoice you tap on that and create and click on create invoice you're going to enter the customer's name customer's email address billing address and all the other information that you need for your customer and then you select the currency if you want to be, be paid in, in the USD or Naira enter the currency and the date range for the invoice so if it's a service you enter the description you enter the quantity and the amount that you are expecting to be paid and once done you can review your invoice and you can decide to save it as a draft or send it out immediately and if I send it out immediately, the um, invoice is going to be sent to my client's email and they're going to receive it like so, and they can tap to pay. Another great feature that's been added to the Rainest app is you can now, you have the um, ability to now pay bills right on the app. So you can tap on pay bills and there are a range of bills that you can pay your electricity, your airtime, you can do your cable TV, your internet, and there are various providers under each of these sections. And say we select the airtime, you can see you can pay for your MTN, your Glow, your Airtel airtime, just as you want. So you enter your details and phone number and everything and the package you want to pay for and tap on continue and pay for your um, airtime or data, whatever you want to do. Same thing applies to all the other services, your electricity, your cable TV, you can see all your carriers, your providers there. You can just select what package you want and make payments right on the app. Another cool feature that's been introduced is the stablecoin wallet. So you can now get paid in more ways. You can now receive stablecoin. You can hold stablecoins right in your Rainest app. So you can do USDT or USDC um, right in the Rainest app. So to create an account, your stablecoin account, if I go into my USD account, um, and tap on the account, you can see I can access my USDC and USDT wallet. So if I tap on one of those um, stablecoin wallets, you can see that I can agree to the terms of service and tap on continue to now um, create a request to create my account. And once it goes through, it's going to be approved. And I now have my USDC and USDT accounts that I can use to receive payments. So the process of receiving um, stablecoin is pretty straightforward. You simply copy your, your wallet address and then send it over to wherever you want to receive money from. Even if you want to pay yourself, you can use that information to receive your, your USDC and your USDT. This is the new refreshed look of the Rainest app, which formerly used to be known as GigPay. Don't forget to take advantage of the free deposits campaign to save some money with every deposit.